Hey guys, it's Deadpool here. You guys would not believe it, but right now I am in Canada on my old stomping grounds, hanging out with my brother Maddie. And today we're gonna go check out his new office. So let's go check it out. I guess I could go in though, because I'm not a visitor, I'm family. Guys, I'm at Dope Squad HQ. It's pretty sweet. It's a lot bigger than it looks like in the videos. Nice plus. But I think I'm done with exploring. Mati, do we still have time to go one wheel before we do the live stream? I think so, depending on how, how long it takes for you to learn how to ride open wheel. <laughs> I'm really scared to go one wheeling because I'm very accident prone. I have had surgeries multiple times and whenever I try something new, there's always a risk of getting hurt. I don't know if I should do this. Mati's teach me vlogging techniques, how to hold the Gorilla Pod because my arm's so stiff all the time. Vlogging 101, let me get my vlogger stick. Well, let me show, I'll show how he holds it because I was holding it up here and my arm gets so tired so he's gonna give me one technique in order to save your biceps from hurting. Now I, I, I have a 60 Mark II <laughs> that's the example here. <laughs> but pretend it's a 1DX. 1DX is a heavy camera, you're gonna get tired. You want to set it up in a, in a kind of a bendy shape like this. And instead of holding it like this, because this is going to get super tiring, like you can't do this for very long. If you want to do it for a longer period of time, tuck the elbow in and hold it like this. Shoot super wide, you're good to go. You can do this for a long time, where this, I'm going to tire it out in like two seconds, so don't do this. All right, Matt is going to take me out one wheeling. If there's one thing you guys know about me, I'm always getting hurt. So I'm a little bit nervous about this, but I think I'm gonna be okay. Are they charged? 60%, 60%. Oh, that's not good. All right, lunch it is. Well, while, while, while we wait, let's, let's tell the audience some of those accidents you've had. You have broken your femur. Yes. You have a gun, somehow you got a cut here. I don't even know how that's possible. You hear your face. Rollerblading, hit Roller my face bedding. on the ground. You busted up your shin one time, you got stitches, right? Backflip to trampoline corner, yes. No, but there's another time too, you were snowboarding. Snowboarding, you shin it smash, like a yes. brain came out. Yes, uh, blew up my shin. You blew up your knee, your yes. tendon. Yes. Your kneecap came out. That was most recent. Let's just say I don't have the luxury of getting hurt anymore because I have so much metal on my legs. I have 20 centimeter plate in my femur. I've got metal on my knee now. And if I have any more metal, I don't think I can travel in the airplanes. I'm pretty scared about this. This is like off-road thunder. We're gonna go like in the forest and everything and... All right guys, I'm gonna show my brother how to ride the one wheel. Uh, hopefully we don't have to go to the hospital oh, after this. I'm sweating right now, the armpits are wet. Ew. All right, so the way the one wheel works is you put your back foot there like that, and then the front wheel has these, this pressure pad and there's this line in between here. You need to apply equal pressure on the front and back of that line. And then, so you put your foot there and then you try to put it to her horizontal. Yeah. And then once it's in horizontal, it'll kick in the motor and then and you just... how do I get off? <laughs> you can't. I just jump off? You, just if you want to bail, if you want to bail, jump off two feet for now. Like we, forwards. You, oh, one, either way. How do I just stop? Like, I just... You just lean back. Okay. Lean forwards to go, lean back to go. Oh. Uh, stop her. Guys, I'm so nervous right now. I don't want to, I don't want to be a cook slams. Oh, you don't have it on. <laughs> <laughs> Number one, first you have to turn this on. <laughs> no wonder, this is impossible. <laughs> All right, attempt again. Guys, wish me luck, pray for me. <laughs> okay, start going forward. No, no, lean forward, lean forward. Oh, it's going already. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's not so hard. Oh, my legs are shaking. <laughs> my brother is struggling right now. All right, try to turn around. Toe turn. Point your toes forwards like on a snowboard and just turn around. Keep pushing forwards. Up, oh, there's a car. You're, you're, you're screwed. Speaking of weight. Look at that. 
turn, oh. first turn executed. Oh, I'm getting better at this. All right, just push forward and get over here. Get out of the way of the cars. Oh, thanks. We're causing a, a, a traffic jam oh, over here. My legs are stopped shaking. I think that's not as easier because I was shaking so hard. You're just being too stiff. You gotta, you gotta loosen up. It's like surfing. Think about it like surfing. That's exactly what it is. Surfing on dry ground. All right, how are you feeling first ride? Oh, I calmed down now. Jump two feet if you need to bail. How do you bail? Jump off. All right, let's go ride some more. You need <gasps> some practice. It's, it's a workout, you wouldn't think so. <laughs> push, just push and turn. <laughs> the slower you go, the harder it is, so just. Alright guys, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the new office as well, seeing me try to tempt the one wheel. I know I looked a little bit out of control, but trust me, by the end of the day, I was getting the hang of it. I don't know what was wrong with me, I think I got just nervous or something, psyched up around it, that my feet were just shaking while I was riding the one wheel, and you know, if you're not loose and just relaxed on the one wheel, it can be disastrous, but thankfully I got a hang of it and I really enjoyed it and had a super good time. For me, it was such a treat to hang out with my brother today because we don't get to see each other too often anymore. You know, back in the day before we were both married, we were hanging out all the time together. Shooting together, hanging out together, and we were like best friends. But always as you get older, you grow up and you get married and you live with your family and now we live in Finland. So today, for example, just to get to hang out together for the whole day, just having fun one wheeling, filming together, it's a really rare treat. Especially as well with summer here, it's so nice just to hang outside and just have a good time. One of the things I respect my brother is, is not only is he super talented and hardworking, but as well he's really supportive. I feel like a lot of times when we're trying to become the best filmmaker or the best YouTuber, it can become really competitive and it's almost like if one person wins or if one person succeeds, it takes away from your success. But following Maddie and for example Maddie and Peter, they've always been about supporting each other and supporting others and they've almost had this mentality that hey if you succeed I succeed and if if you gain from this I gain from this somehow and I really always appreciate that about Maddie. even with my own YouTube channel he's always been supporting me teaching me and just helping me out learning and just get better at my craft and I just want to encourage you guys as well you know let's not get insecure and just try to hog this success to ourselves but let's help each other out Let's help each other become better filmmakers, better photographers, and just in general, better people because, you know, there's no point in getting into this whole success thing and just trying to become the best, but then realizing when you get to the top that you're all alone at the top because maybe you just use people or just not treated people the way that you should have. So instead of letting our securities take over, guys, let's be supporting each other. Let's help each other out, get better and grow and just go forwards in our own filmmaking. Guys, I realize that this is a little bit different of a video than usual, but these are just some of the thoughts on my mind when I was hanging out with Maddie today, and I just thought I would love to share them with you guys, encourage you guys, and just push you guys forward, and just to help you guys realize that it's all about helping others rather than just trying to get to the top by ourselves. Guys, if you like this video, you know what to do. Make sure you smash that like button and subscribe to the channel so that you are up to date with my most recent videos. Now that it's summertime, I'm finding that I have a lot more motivation to get out and film because, well, you remember my winter videos. It's not that easy to get out in the winter, but now that it's summertime and it's warm, I'm out filming and just loving this YouTube life. So guys, have a great evening, enjoy the rest of the day, and go and support some other filmmakers.